Hi everyone and welcome back to Jurassic Explains and today we have Feastables! The variety pack came with chocolate, quinoa crunch, and almond. And this variety pack comes with six of those bars a piece and it cost about 50 bucks. So something that's really cool about this is that it's a contest. So each bar has a code that you peel off and you enter the code and you see if you win a prize. What are some of the prizes? Of course money when you're dealing with Mr. Beast and you can even be on a future episode of his where you could win a chocolate factory. Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. Yes, and that's what we're going for here. Surely there's got to be a winner in this box. We're going to be taste testing and we're going to see if we win anything. I would definitely love to be Willy Wonka. So sit back, relax, and watch us try these candy bars. And see if we win anything. I do like the box. I like the color. I like the design he has. Ooh, yeah, they're like big wide chocolate bars. Okay. Yeah, they're big. Kind of like the structure of Nestle Crunch. The first chocolate bar we're going to be trying is the original chocolate. Oh. Now each of us are going to have our own chocolate bar because we have six of each. We're going to eat all of it now? Yep, we're going to eat all the candy right I'm now. Not no, I'm not hungry enough for that. But we're still oh. going to peel off all of the stickers because we have to see if we won. But I wanted to have my own chocolate bar to eat right now. Okay, because they break up into pieces. Mine broke. It smells like dark chocolate. It does smell like dark chocolate. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers like dark chocolate. Oh, I like dark chocolate. It ain't bad. Definitely dark chocolate. I know he did say that it, he was making it healthier. Yeah. It's cane sugar, organic chocolate, organic cocoa butter. <laughs> and sunflower whatever. <laughs> Makes sense. It would have the taste of dark chocolate more. Mm -hmm. I can't eat this whole piece right now. Especially if I gotta eat those. Oh, I can. Alright, so let's see if we got winners. Technically you won't know until you put in the code. Are we just gonna peel them off and then put them all in? I think or so. What? That sounds good to me because we paid for them. <laughs> yes, and hopefully one of these will be a winner and we'll let y'all know. Moving on to the next chocolate bar. The next chocolate bar we're gonna be trying today is Quinoa Crunch. And thanks to my wife's thinking, we're only gonna open up one of these chocolate bars at a time. Although I wanna open up two, but she's like, we need to save some for later on, which makes perfect sense. I am just hungry. Oh, it says share. And devour. Yeah, they say share and devour. Um, I'm gonna eat the piece that says share. Oh, I just smell it. <laughs> well, again, it smells like dark chocolate. And it's like a dark chocolate Nestle Crunch. Yeah. I like that he's used healthier ingredients such as quinoa mm -hmm. because it's like a Nestle's Crunch bar except it's healthier. It's a win-win for everybody. I mean, it's a chocolate bar. What do you want from it, you know? But I will say it does melt in your hand. They're a little melty, but damn, are they exquisite. Oh, uh, true. Moving on to the last bar. And the last bar we're going to be trying is the almond chocolate. I have a feeling these are going to taste like dark chocolate almonds. Bars. <laughs> yeah. They actually taste like a chocolate bar. Now you get some chocolate bars and they have like kind of like a waxy kind of consistency to them and you know they just Easter taste like candy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like they just taste like they've been old and processed and you're like you feel like you're eating plastic. Eh. But these, these are delicious. I'm gonna leave them in the package here and we're just gonna grab it. Okay, that works for we're me. We're getting better at Yeah, it. we're getting better by the third <laughs> chocolate bar. Okay, smells like dark chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> the almond pieces look to be pretty small though. They're not like Hershey's almonds. Yeah. Same thing with the crunch. I expected a little more almond. You know, I'm with you. I would have liked a little bit more almond with that one, but that's still good. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to try the codes for the sweepstakes from all these chocolate bars and let you know what is the probability of you winning when you buy a $50 box of candy bars from Mr. Beast. Yep. Surely, like, one of them will be a winner, right? I would hope. Out of $50 and 18 candy bars, it better be at least one. Okay, I think I'm on it now. And two. Here we go. We're going to do it on both our phones so that this will go quicker. And we're just going to make a pile of winners and losers. That was unfortunate. I was doing my code upside down. Bless his heart. <laughs> <laughs> so then you get a spin to win. I'm spinning. Oh, one! Congratulations, you have won Mr. Beast merch I bundle won too. one. Oh, all right. You've won a mystery video from Mr. Beast. Oh, nice. 
Your entry has also automatically entered you into all the major prize sweepstakes drawings. So play again. A few minutes later. So, here's our not winner pile. 15 out of the 18 were not winners, but three of them were. And one of them which, Marissa won a free Mr. Beast Burger. Well, it was a $5 off Mr. Beast Burger. Oh, sorry. Well, I'm assuming that's it has to be close to like getting one free, right? Yeah. I don't know how much Mr. Beast Burger is. And then also, I won some merch. And uh, we have one, another one that just put us in for another big entry. Is that different than the other? I'm not quite sure. I really am not. It says though, uh, even if you lost, you get put into the big sweepstakes drawing. And the, I think the deadline is April 15th. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we're excited to see what happens with this sweepstakes. And the candy bars were pretty delicious. And this is a fun little thing. Mr. Beast always does cool stuff like this where he's giving out money and things to people. You know, he definitely is one of the best in the business. Oh yeah, he's like the best YouTuber out there. If you have never seen his show before, I highly suggest you go and watch it. Alright ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to the end of our taste testing of the Mr. Beast bars. Yes, and testing to see if we won. We did win some things, so I'm pretty excited. And we could win some stuff coming up here in the future, which we will let you all know if we do. Yes. We want to thank you all for watching. Give us some likes and subscribe and ring that bell for future notifications. And you can follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Jarissa Explains. And we will see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye.